Let's pull the white ones back. He comes off the water treatment. He comes off of there. He comes off there. This one comes back injured, but brings the two new workers with him. And there we go. All right, so let's roll for threat again. Top row. We have got an 11. And an 11 is over here in the diner. So the diner has rad roaches. You never want roaches in your diner. So we've got rad roaches now in the diner. But fortunately, they are pretty easy. They're just a five. What about the second row? We've got, we can get things on the second row from an eight, nine, 10, or 11 now because of putting in that second room. And it is a seven, which is the elevator, and elevators never get threats. So we're okay there. All right, we need some food, if that was possible, to heal our guy, if we wanted to go there, but. We can't go there, so we're gonna send him instead to there and just heal him up for nothing. But he won't level up. Will not level up. All right, four more guys. I'm going to send one to the water treatment plant and get a water. Then I'm going to send One to the power generator. That'll get us two more power. Then I will spend one to the storeroom. And we will convert power to food. So I am going to convert... Hmm. Yep, power to food. I'm going to convert... Two power to two food. Using that right there. And then I am going to send this guy here. And we're going to build the garden with three power and two food. So I get rid of the two power the two food and the three power. Go. and we are going to get the garden and I'm going to put the garden out here on this end and now the garden only this one can get this one over here can never get a thread in it so we've got guaranteed food now just like we always have guaranteed power and this guy because of that needs to get two happiness and his two happiness will add up with these three so we are going to end up with another times five we're now at 10 happiness. Not doing too bad. All right, let's withdraw our blue guys again. This one comes back. This one comes back injured. He comes back. And this one comes back with endurance. So he'll be sitting here with endurance as a special. <sighs> Lord almighty. Yeah, we really need to take out that death claw. That would be nice. I'm going to send this guy back out into the wasteland. He's going to burn one water with it. We're going to get a gift, and I'm going to take the camera, which gives us happiness for every two hours. Put that on the happiness stack. Replenish. We've got a parrot. Exhaust when building a room and pay one fewer resource. That is nice. Nice to have a pet. But speaking of rooms... Let's pull this one out. And we didn't roll for threat, did we? We need to do that as well. Oh, one of my favorites of the game, a Nuka Cola bottle. It's three energy, a food and a water, and you can get food and water there. Yes, Nuka Cola bottle. That we definitely want. Let's roll for threat. We did not do that at the round, so we need to roll for the top level. Top level's threat is a 10, which will be 8, 9, 10. 10's already got a raider on it, so that's okay. Second level 
is going to be a 4, which is over here, so nothing happens there. So that's okay. And though we kind of sort of skipped it there, we're all right. Okay, we've sent one guy out into the wasteland. He's gotten a gift. We now need to send... Send this guy to the med bay. So he'll heal up, and when he does, he'll come back with endurance. I'm going to send one guy into the garden. And in the garden, he's going to get three food. And we are really starting to do well with our, our spaces here. And now, these last two guys... One with the endurance, and this one we're going to send after the death claw again, and we need a nine. Eight. What if I told you? Eight. Eight. Let's burn the missile launcher. Two roll. And this time a seven. So we've got two more injured guys. No, 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 no! What's, what's with this? What, what's with that death claw? Oh my God, what is with that guy? Alrighty, that was the blue folks. So let's bring the white ones back. He comes back, you come back, you come back, you come back, and you come back. Nobody's got any extra, extra items going on. No one's got anything extra bonuses or level up. So we got all five of those. We're gonna roll for replenish our missile launcher, roll for threat, we've got a 9, 7, 8, 9, which is the feral ghoul, so it's okay, now let's roll for the second level, second level's got an 8, which is here in the med bay, so we've just healed that guy up, and we've just re-injured him, and he gets glowing red scorpions. No, 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 we need some no. weapons. We really do need some weapons. All right. So now what are we going to do with the white ones? All right. Hmm. Um. First. I'm going to send this dude over here to the power generator. We're going to get two power. Now, I'm going to send this one up here to the power outage. He'll use the two of the power. That will, you see it? That will turn off the power outage. And I will use the lab coat to increase him in intelligence, which is what we need. So we'll get two happiness for that. So bring the two happy over. And we now have 12 happiness. So we are building up our points here. Very good. Next up, we've got three guys left. Um, I'm going to send one to water treatment. We'll get a water cube for that. And I will send one over here to the garden. We'll get two more food. Food is almost full. And I'm going to send one to over here at the power generator. And we'll get one more power. So we're building up the... Now that we're, you know, as you get kind of get an engine going and you get more rooms up, you start getting more... Uh, start in uh, your, your, your um, resources aren't quite as big a problem as they were before. All right, let's untap the lab coat. Let's roll for threats. Oh, me. First roll is a four. And four's got glowing red scorpions on it, so it cannot be hurt. Whoops, whoops, whoops. Which one did I not bring? I brought... Oh, I need to bring the blue ones back, don't I? Yep, need to bring the blue ones back. So bring these back. Bring this one back. Bring that injured one back. And bring that one off the garden. All right, so we got three injured ones. We only have two things we can do this turn, and we're not going to be able to re heal one of our injured ones if we can't get rid of that gla glowing rad scorpion. So that's our problem. All right. Anyway, nothing on the top row because we already had glowing rad scorpions. 
And the second row is a seven, so nothing on the elevator space. All right, I'm going to have a cup of my tea, and then we'll get back to the next round here. All right, I am back. We are over. We've got eight threats left, so we are over halfway through the, uh, the game timer here. Now, I am going to send one guy up here to the elevator and get him healing. I'm going to spend one guy over here and spend a food and get him healing and we'll do the level one up. And I'm going to... I'm going to fight the glowing red scorpion. Mm -hmm. Actually, man, yeah, let's go ahead. We really need to clear that other healing space. I'm going to put him there. We will use the power armor and tap it and burn a power, and that will let us pretend that we've got endurance. We're going to need a nine or higher. Come on, we've got to be able to roll higher than an eight. Six. All right. We'll tap the missile launcher and re-roll. There's three this time. Oh my god. No, no, oh, any no, no, person no, in the middle, eh? That's an appropriate spot for him. We can't do anything with the other injured dude, so we've got one guy left. Oh my god. And I'm going to send him out into the wasteland. I burn our last water. And he is going to grab the parrot. And the parrot allows us to spend one less resource when we build a room. And that is the end of a miserable round. Okay, let's bring the whites back. Two off the power generator. The one out of the garden. Y'all were at least productive. The one out of the water treatment. The one over here at the power outage comes back. And the power outage goes away. So we've got the power back on in the vault entrance. Uh, and let's roll for, let's re, uh, unexhaust our cards here, and let's roll for threat. First level. Went off the edge, so we got a four, and a four is an eight, which is the water treatment. All right, glowing rad roaches, of course. Why wouldn't they be glowing rad roaches? Look at the second row. Second row is going to be a 12. Of course it is. So we now got something in the garden. And what do we got in the garden? We've got more rad roaches in the garden. Fortunately, we still got that food space there that can never have anything on it. Okay. Very nice. Very sweet. Very sweet indeed. I think... I can't believe we didn't take out that Grand Roaches. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to send one of the guys over here to take out these Red Roaches. They need a five or higher. He got it. He got a seven. So the Red Roach has been eliminated. I am going to therefore spend the point of energy in our power armor and that will allow us to pretend that he is trained in agility so that instead of one resource we can get two resources. So I am going to grab those two resources. Oh, what would we like? Um, I am really, really thinking about that Nuka Cola bottle. Yeah. And we need a. I'm going to make those be water. So we got two water for defeating that Rad Roach. Now I'm going to spin. Oh, we didn't. We got the parrot. We didn't flip over the night one, which is nightwear, pajamas, exhaust on your turn to train it in charisma. Very good, because we can use some charisma in some of these places. Okay, now I am going to 
send this guy over here to the power generator. I don't have anything that increases strength, so he's gonna get two power. And then we'll send the next guy here and get one power. I'm going to send a person here. There you go. And he is going to spend the three energy, one food, and one water to get the Nuka Cola bottle. So three energy, one food, and one water. And we're going to get the Nuka Cola bottle. And we have to put it on this side because we already got three over here. We can only have three on each side of the elevator. So this one has to go over here on this side now. Right. Excellent. We need to remember to pull out the next room this time. The next room is a radio station. A radio station you can spend food to get dwellers. Not quite as not quite as good in late game. But a good thing to have if you've got a, a situation where, you know, people are always grabbing the vault entrance and stuff like that before you, that's a nice one to have. It gives you more places. Oh, and in the real game, in the multiplayer game, you can use other people. Like if, you know, let's say this was somebody's row and this was my row, I could go to their row and use their spaces. It's just they get a free resource anytime I do that. So that's cool. All right. Oh, what do we got? We got one person left. And with that one person, I am going to go to the Nuka Cola bottler. And he's going to get two food and a water. So I'm going to come in here. Two food and one water. Nuka Cola is a great, great thing. All right. Now we pull the blue ones back. So they all come back. This one comes back and he gets to train in anything. This one comes back wounded. Oh, what do we want to train in? I'm thinking we will train in... Hmm. I'm going to train him in luck. So he's going to be trained with an L. All right. Now, we roll for threats. Let's see how that goes. Pop row. Threat is a five, which is the vault entrance again. The vault entrance has been taken over with a rad scorpion. Second row is a seven again, so nothing on the second row. All right. First dude will go to the elevator. He will get restored. Second dude will go here. I need to spend a food, which I will spend. And he gets restored. And he'll get trained up when he comes back. Now, I did that luck because... I'm going to spin the guy that has the luck to the Nuka Cola bottle. Because he's got the ale, he gets two food, two water. So we have filled up our food now. And we have got four water as well. So we're doing good there. I said late game, when you start getting the bonuses and you start getting these, these nice rooms out, things improve quite a bit. <sighs> All right. Damn, I need some energy and that doesn't work. Oh, jeez. All right, I'm going to send this guy out into the wasteland to burn the water. He's going to get gifts. And the gifts we're going to grab is... Charisma? Yeah, we'll take, we'll take another piece of clothing. We have, if I remember right, we have a item here that gives you bonuses, happiness bonuses for clothing. So we'll take that. What's going to be the next gift? The next gift is going to be a husky. Exhaust it to exchange water and food at the rate shown. 
Ooh, 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 I forgot something too. I had the parrot. I was going to exhaust the parrot whenever I built that. Yeah, I was going to exhaust the parrot whenever I built the Nuka Cola bottle. So uh, let me get an energy back. There we go. Yeah, get that energy back, exhausting the parrot. And now. Oh, but that screws up that. Oh, man. All right, we'll have to do that next turn. All right, I was going to say, and then we'll send that, but we can't do that either. So I am going to spin him over here. Man, I can't do food. Oh, Lord, where do I want to put people? You know what? No, no risk, no honor. Let's push our luck here. I am going to send him after the feral ghoul. He's going to need a seven or higher. And I am going to burn the lab coat. And let's see if he can get a seven. And he got a five. So great. Yet another injured worker. No, 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 nice. no! Hey right, guys, okay. That was the blues. Now let's bring the white ones back. Uh, make sure none of them get trained up in anything. None of them do, but he take, oh, he killed the rad roaches? He did, he took out the rad roaches, didn't he? Oh Lord, I'm, ugh, I got to start paying more attention here. Red roaches, yes, he did, because I think I used that, I'm, we're gonna say I used that, that question mark to get water. Why not? We're gonna pretend that I did. Okay, I've got to slow down a little bit and start remembering that I need to do things in order so that I pay all my costs and get all my bonuses down here and get all my rewards. All right, let's check for threats. Threats on the top row where there really aren't too many places we got to worry about anymore because it's so overloaded is an eight and an eight's got glowing rad roaches on it. So we're good there. Second row. Second row has an eight and an eight has got glowing rad roaches on it. So we're okay there. One thing about not clearing off threats is you don't get that many more added to the board, do you? All right. Now, the white ones. Okay. Let's take on that, that damn death claw. I'd like to take out the, What's that death claw got underneath it? Oh, all he does is level up luck, so. We're actually gonna hold off on him because he injures two of our workers every darn time. Let's just hold off. Okay. Um, instead, I'm gonna send a guy out here to power. So he'll get two power. I'm going to send, I've still got workers that I can't bring off the board. So I need to get rid of those rad scorpions. So I'm going to send a guy to go after the rad scorpions. They need an eight or higher, and we love rolling eights, don't we? So let's go ahead and roll it. Come on, eight or higher. And of course we got a five now. Let's tap our missile launcher. And let's roll again. And of course we get snake eyes. Of course we can't roll an eight to literally save our life now. No, 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 no! We got three workers left. Let's get. I'm gonna go to the. I don't need. See, I don't need the food. We're full of food. I'm gonna go over here get another energy power generator, so we get one more energy, and then I'm going to go a couple of combats, maybe? Sure, why not? Why not? Let's clear some of these guys off the board, damn it. I'm going to go after the rad roaches, and we need a five. 
let's see if we can't roll a five or higher to get rid of the rad race. We did. We got an eight. Imagine that. There's our eight. So we got the rad roaches. I'm going to burn a power to use the armor. And tap the armor, and that will consider him an A. So we get any resource of our choice. I'm going to use that for two resources of our choice. And I'm going to get to water. So our water's back up to a five. And we'll be able to take those rad roaches off the damn board. And next up, let's get this last guy and let's go after the glowing rad roaches. We won't be able to get an extra bonus this time, but hopefully we'll be able to take him out. We need a six or higher. And we got a four, so we got another injured. Those rad no, roaches no, are tough. No, no, no! Okay, guys. All right, let's bring back all our blue people. We healed up. Okay, all except for that guy. All right, what do we want to heal this? What do we want to give this guy this time? I think I'm going to give him. Um, I am going to give him an E. We're going to train him in endurance. All right, now, power station, radio station. Suddenly, with that rad scorpion sitting over there, that radio station starts looking a lot better, doesn't it? It does indeed. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to move this guy here. We didn't roll for threat, did we? Nope, we didn't. I just pulled them back. Let's go ahead and roll for threat. 